from the Strip Studios. This is 10 News. Hi, I'm Jason Martinez with this 10 News update. The Santa Ana winds picking up today and fire officials are concerned the winds will quickly dry out brush and trees becoming fuel for a wildfire. Red flag warning started at 3 a.m. and is in effect until tomorrow at 8 p.m. Fire officials have pre-stationed crews throughout the county and they've staffed their emergency operations center as well. The son of a Chargers legend is back in court today. Kellen Winslow Jr. facing multiple charges, including three rapes. He has pleaded not guilty. One of the alleged victims was an unconscious 17 year old. Last month, the judge postponed Winslow's preliminary hearing to give him more time to recover from leg surgery and give his lawyers more time to prepare his defense. And today you can park at the airport for free as part of a new parking service called Travel Car. Outbound travelers can share their vehicles with incoming travelers at the airport. To do that, you have to list your car on the company's website and then park in their lot. Then the company shares your car with a trusted client. The company says they inspect the cars before and after use. So let's get more on those Santa Ana's with Megan. That's right. So we're in a red flag warning through tomorrow evening, as you heard Jason just mentioned. So winds generally out of the northeast between 20 to 45 miles per hour is what will most of us will see occasional gusts up to. However, some gusts could reach all the way up to about 60 miles per hour. That would be in some of the more typically wind prone areas, blowing dust, blowing sand an issue, especially in the deserts. And the deserts are actually going to be pretty windy as well. Wind advisory in effect for the coast and the deserts through this evening. The red flag warning is in effect for the valleys, also our mountains. Most of the county in the 70s and 80s today, a lot cooler in the mountains in the 50s. We will keep those breezy winds through tomorrow, but along our coast, those winds will really come down quite a bit as we head into tonight. We'll stay in the 70s and 80s all week along our coast. We may see another round of Santa Ana winds develop Thursday night into Friday, so we'll keep our eyes on that. Low to mid 80s through the extended for our inland neighborhoods. The mountains back into the 60s tomorrow with 80s for the most part this week in our deserts, and there may be a chance for some rain as we head into Sunday. Jason. Thank you very much, Megan. And so for the latest news, weather and traffic, always check out 10news.com or download our free 10 News app in your app store. For 10 News, I'm Jason Martinez.